Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of A Gaming. Today I am playing Morai. It's me, Chris. Uh, I hope I pronounced that right. This is a game that JC and Alex recommended I play. I have no idea what it's about. And I'm just gonna I'm just gonna give it a try and see what's see what's up what's up with this game. So press space to start. Thank you, Chris Johnson, Brad Barrett, and John Osaman. To, for making the music, graphics, and design of this game. So yeah, we're gonna get started. I hope there's no jump scares. Last time you had me play a game, there was jump scares. Okay. Oh. Oh. Okay, we're gonna talk to the priest. Hello. Talk to priest. Space. My prayers go out to you. <clears throat> this is a true test of reading this. My prayers go out to poor Julia. It's been a year since her husband has passed. She hasn't been seen all day. I imagine she is grieving. Do you mind visiting her at her home? It's the house to the right as you leave town. Fine, I guess if I have to, I'm gonna talk to the little redhead kid first. So talk to boy, that's a weird name. Need to stay close to mama, otherwise she'll worry that we've run off. Well, with those little legs that you got there, buddy, I don't think you're gonna be running far. <laughs> okay, um... Okay. I'm gonna talk to Mother. Did you hear about the boy? Julia just lost her... What? <clears throat> Did you hear about the boy? Julia lost her son in a cave shortly after her husband died. Poor Julia. She has really bad luck. I would never let my boys out of my sight. Of course you would. Okay, um... Yeah, that sucks for the mother, sh or, no, Julia, not the mother, the mother didn't lose any kids. She's a good mother, she wouldn't take her eyes off her kids. Talk to girl. Sometimes, daddy lets- <laughs> It's a weird girl voice. I'm just gonna- this is the girl voice. Sometimes, daddy lets us pat the sheep on the head. They're so soft. How is that helping? <laughs> that was really helpful, little lady. Why do they all stare at me? This is really creepy. Okay, so last house on the- so this is how you leave the town. Read signpost. To the farm. I don't want to go to the farm yet. I'm gonna go see Julia in her crib. I hope this is her crib. Nice crib. I don't think I'm in the right crib. Look at bookshelf. There is a picture on the shelf of a wife, husband, and a young boy. I wonder where they are. Well, obviously, they ain't not here. This is a lamp. Is this lamp a human? This is a lamp. Lamp. It looks like a blue man wearing a hat with a string in front of it. That, or it's a lone dread. Anyways, we're gonna go. We're gonna go to every cabin because this is my town. I have declared myself mayor of this town. Oh, you're a prisoner. I'm out. I'm just kidding. I'm going back in now. I thought I couldn't go back in for a second. Okay, talk to girl. My uncle and dad are out chopping wood to keep us warm in the winter. They should be home soon. <laughs> probably, <laughs> this is probably bad. I just kind of show up and this little girl is just in her cabin all alone. And then the mayor of the town is just like, I'm here now. And then it's not great. Okay, here we go. What's going on in this cabin here? Probably a whole bunch of awesome stuff. Oh, you look like a scary man. Can I look at your bookshelf? And no. Talk to you. It looks like a lovely day outside. You should head out to the farm if you get the chance. Spend some time with the animals. Like the chickens and stuff. I don't... I don't... Chef... I'll do that, Chef. You're a nice, kind man. What's going on in this cabin here? It's a little dwarf man. It's a boy. I heard there is gold in the cave, but I'm too scared to enter. They say a little boy that haunts over your shoulder. Wait, let me read that bottom. They say there's a little boy that haunts over your shoulder. Oh, that's how you say it. That's how you do it. The blue man with his hat and dread is in your room too, just to let you know. He's probably the ghost. That's the secret of this game. It's a ghost story, and the blue man has just been over the little boy's shoulder in the rooms. I figured it out. I don't have to play this game anymore. End playthrough right now. Okay. Time to go to the funny farm. Oh, there's so much farm going on right now. Oh, I like it. I like it a lot. Some gate. Farm. Neat. 
Now I know where I am. I'll never. <gasps> Can I pet the sheep? <laughs> ah, I bought it, man. I'm gonna make all the sheep buy. Look at that. Great sheep physics. Neat. That one sounded like a burp. Like. Oh, change. <laughs> I'm just gonna keep poking. That's my best imitation. Oh, okay, here we go. Need to go poke this sheep. Happy sheep. I better get an achievement for poking all the sheeps. Neat sheep. Tell me your story, sheep. Really, is that so, eh? How about you? You just ate dinner, didn't you? Uh, well. That one sounded like he's like, Oh, help! He's falling down a cliff, sheep. He's falling down a cliff, sheep. I like falling down. You're my new favorite sheep. You're my sheep friend. If I could take anybody on this trip, it would be you. You're just another boring sheep following all the other sheep. And you're burping sheep again. Okay. Was that all the sheep? I hope it was. I'll talk to you again just to make sure. Yeah, fallen sheep. Okay. Fallen sheep, fallen sheep, fallen sheep on the ground. Okay. Um, can I go in you? Open barn door. Oh, freaking who locks barns? That's probably where the Julia is hiding, living, spending her days playing Pokemon inside there. Not the DS version either, like the freaking, freaking card game one. Hey, there's a man. What does your sign say? Two of the cave. Pick up lantern. Picked up lantern on stump. <laughs> I love my little hand. Oh. My brother and I were chopping wood when we heard means coming from a cave. Oof. Jeez Louise. When we heard moans coming from the cave, my brother went in to investigate. He should have been back by now. I'm worried. Can you check on him? There's a lantern behind you on that stump. I already grabbed your lantern. I didn't even have to. I didn't even have to. Even have to ask. I just take what I want. Can I take your pickaxe and go into your barn for a second? I don't want to go in the barn. It was locked. Do one of the keys hold the gate? I mean, sheep hold the keys to the gate. I'm just gonna go in the cave. Caves mean spiders, and spiders mean jump scares. Trying to set me up for a jump scare, Mr. Stary Man. You might be the last face I see. Let me, let me, let me. Okay, we're out. Thank you. I don't know what I wanted to do. Okay. Here we go. Into the cave. Oh, I'm gonna. Here, come over here. I'm coming. It's a wizard! Did you did my brother send you? Bless. You're like five feet away from the exit. Why are you, Why aren't you going? Okay. Did my brother send you? Bless you. <laughs> Let me try that at reading. Let me try that again. Did my brother send you? Bless. I'm the moans. Oh, wait. The moans are coming from further down. I go, but I'm scared is what you're just trying to say. You should take this knife. Who knows? You may need it. Jab. Well, this game just kind of... Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, man. Oh, no. Oh, no. We're just gonna be stuck in here forever, aren't we? I took a... Oh. Hey, a thing. Someone must have died here. The bones look as though they are a child. Oh, is that the song? Oh, that's not good at all. What is this? What can tell? I could see something shiny. It's just out of my reach. I see something shiny. It's just out of my reach. Oh, man. I'm going to be lost in this cave forever. Okay. Well, there's child's bones. Better get a, a dog down here. Dogs love bones. That's kind of weird. Probably not human bones, but... <laughs> I was just thinking bones, dogs, dog like bones, you know, is this where the man is? Okay, thank goodness. Can I talk to you about the bones? Go ahead, I can't say it. Thanks, okay. We're gonna go right this time. And we're gonna get eaten by a Sam Squatch. Probably, this is just Sam Squatch Simulator 2019. Okay. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, the oh, stuff. Look at tools. There are some tools leaning up against the wall. It looks as though they've been used to mark carvings on the walls. How many? Wow, that's a lot of carves. Jeez Louise. Holy moly, what is this? Look at book. There's a book on top of the pedestal. It's labor labeled farmers. There's a list of names inside. Uh ZK420. What <laughs> Andrew. I like these names. Oh, they're like usernames. What? How eerie. <laughs> okay. Is there anything behind the pedestal? No, okay, I can't get back there. Can I take the tools? No, okay. Um. Okay. I don't hear any moans, though. Or is it, I just have bad hearing. Okay, um. Okay, can I talk to you about the tools? God, I can't see. You're just blind. You're the demon looking over my shoulder. Just gotta look in every crevice. Oh! Oh no, there's a mouse on the ground. A scary mouse. Oh, I don't want to talk to you. A farmer approach. No, I can't leave now. <laughs> what do you have? Why do you have a knife? Iron Man's, what have you done? Um. Oh gosh. This is the deal breaker right here. So the suggestions that I have. Why do you have blood on your overalls? Why do you have a knife? I heard moans, what have you done? Let him pass, attack. Write down in the comments what you think I should do. Uh, polls are open. Do, 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 do. I'm just stalling now. Okay. Uh, you know, the obvious answer is to attack, but I should probably ask him. The pizza rolls were overcooked. Let him pass. <laughs> um, I heard moans. What have you done? I'm going to try that. I heard them can't wait. I heard them. They came for me. I won't let them get to me. Not even you. Why do you have a knife? Rambling. Oh, man. What's going on here? Um. I say I'm just gonna let him pass. All right, I will let you go. He's he is uh that was weird. I should I probably should have attacked him. Okay um another mousey mouse. I'm gonna die, aren't I? Is this where the jump scare comes? Oh no. Okay, please help me. I'm in, I am in a lot of pain. I came here to end my life. My name is Julia and I want to see my child and husband in heaven. My husband was a miner. That's kind of illegal, you know, in these caves. He spent days mining for gold and then one day he found something. He found a golden nugget. I thought we could retire, but retire and be comfortable for the rest of our lives, but he didn't trust me. He buried the golden nugget to spite me. Then he disappeared. Everyone in the town heard about our good fortune. They thought I was rich. I was so ashamed that I couldn't tell them the truth. One day my son wandered into the cave. He wanted to find his daddy. He wanted to make everything better. But he never came out of the cave. I went to look for him, but I couldn't find him. Now it's too late. Now I have nobody. Will you help me? Will you help me end my life? Fudge. Oh, the farmer's gonna set me up because, oh no. Oh no. The farmer man's just gonna murder everyone. What the heck? Oh, this is hard decisions, man. I'm going. Uh, I'm gonna get help. 
Then leave me, you coward. Oh no. Oh jeez, that's gross. Oh wait. Oh, that's not good. Either way, then it would have been bad. Can I just? Oh no. This is bad news, bears. Everybody's gonna try. The farmer's gonna frame me. I'm gonna get burnt. The sheep are gonna betray me. Even though falling down sheep was my friend, he's gonna try. But then all his other sheep friends are gonna be like, "No, it was. He obviously did it." And I'll just be, "Oh no." Why are you here now? <sighs> I don't like you. A farmer approaches. What the frigs? Why do you have blood on your overalls? <laughs> what? Oh man. Um. Uh. Shoot. What's a good? Uh. Chris. Miss Turkey sucked. Um, Christmas turkey mishap. <laughs> Why do you have a knife? Why? Why? Sh um, um, I like to <laughs> uh, use it for cool tricks watch this <laughs> and then I'm gonna put the star st stabs uh, not throat stabs oh, kneecap N kneecap <laughs> I heard moans what have you done I stabbed my Knee cap. <laughs> Let me see what will happen to you. What? Oh no! What? He he murdered my. <laughs> Cause I stabbed my kneecap. <coughs> what the? <laughs> That's a. Well, it is up to the next player of this game to choose your fate, just as you choose for the previous player. Enter your first name. I'm gonna put C H R I S. Enter your email address. Oh. Press space to submit your details. <laughs> Is was what what the f what? Okay, so that was um. What game was that? That was Om Omni and oh, uh, that was different. I guess I'm gonna get an email now saying what happened in the game. Uh, I'm so confused now. I don't know where my sheep friends are anymore. It just all left me. That was kind of something. All right. Okay. Uh, well, on that note, I want to thank you guys all for watching and in. Bring your A-game for the next video, yo-yo. Okay, peace out. Bye-bye. Oh, oh. How do I do this to hop? Sorry, alt F8. Okay, that was professional. Oh, that was, that, that was different. I don't, I don't, yeah.